Hi, my name is Pat and I'm the lead designer of Tiebreak. Today, I'll be going through new features and game updates for Early Access Free. Introducing the new players for Early Access Free. Winner of six ATP titles and ranked 16th in the world, Cameron Hachinov. Representing Australia with a career high ranking of 20, Daria Saville. From Croatia, with three ATP titles and world ranking of 33, Bona Koric. Winner of six WTA titles and ranked number 11th in the world, Daria Hasekina. Representing Canada, with five ATP titles and the career high ranking of six, Felix Jose Eliasim. From Estonia, the recently retired former world number two, Annette Kontevay. From Japan, with two ATP titles and a career high ranking of 24, Yoshihito Nishioka. And finally, from Poland, holding 19 WTA titles and the current world number one, Iga Savontek. Introducing online tournaments, a new feature enabling players to compete in fully licensed ATP and WTA online events, earning valuable ranking points. Participate across the whole season and scale the ATP and WTA leaderboards to become world number one. Ranking points are reset at the start of each tournament, so players must perform consistently to keep their status. We're happy to announce that the venue creator is now available in Tiebreak Academy. Dive into the world of customization as you craft your very own personal tennis venue. Share your creation with other players or explore and download venues crafted by other users in the Tiebreak community. Mix and match main, show and outer courts, selecting from a variety of stadiums and grandstands to design your perfect venue or create a beloved favorite. With the venue creator tools, you have the power to customize everything from the colors of the stands, walls and courts to adding your own sponsor logos seamlessly integrated from our logo creator. The venue creator is full of possibilities and we look forward to seeing your creations. As heavily requested from our fans, we have enhanced the fluidity of player movement animations. Players now exert more authentic kinetic motion as they navigate the court. In this demonstration, the player loads onto his left leg, preparing to execute a push-off in the direction of his intended movement. Miscalculating the trajectory of a shot can cause severe consequences, diminishing the window of opportunity to execute a timely response. Such misjudgments may compel a player into hastily attempting a shot, or worse yet, lead to failure. We have fine-tuned the capability to swiftly advance towards the net, whether it be in the pursuit of a drop shot or to assert dominance in the volley game. Press RT and LT and move forward to scramble. Returning a serve has become more challenging. Players must accurately judge the direction of the serve and position themselves at the appropriate distance to retrieve it. Otherwise, you could be ace. We have refined the readability of the power meter bar. The power meter remains blue when charging shots, but will now change to red once a shot becomes overpowered. Thank you for joining us on our early access journey and for continuing to provide invaluable feedback as we expand tiebreak. Your support means everything to us and we can't wait to reveal what's in store for the next update.